CBC Radio Canada is an institution in Canada, and we have this big hub in Montreal. We had to construct a whole new building with every media that Radio Canada has. Talk radio channels, music radio channels, there's news TV, entertainment TV. The building also produces for uh, web content. It was one of those key projects that was first in 2110 for live production over TV, radio, play out. When we started the reflection about the NMRC project, we, we had no idea what the future would bring. It started with a smart and good move. CBC merged their IT and broadcast engineering teams under one leadership. We were not ready to really understand fully what it meant uh, and how much work it would be. And the equipment out there that, that was available to us was uh, fairly new, but we knew that if we were to go SDI, we'd have probably to rebuild everything, including the backbone and all the cabling, within a few years. We had to build the most agile, flexible and scalable uh, infrastructure. We had two choices, either stay with what we know as the eye, uh, which was already a dying technology. I think it was the best decision to, to go IP. Now, we have the network cable that reached the wall box. If I have the, the, the stream in my network, then I can distribute it, no matter if it's an audio, a video, a auxiliary data stream. Having an IP network with all of our audio, video, media accessible to everyone, basically, allows us to share resources, share facilities. In a fully 2110 facility, everything is routable everywhere. Today, that roughly translates to about 50,000 essence that, that we carry over the, the network. All of the TV control rooms basically use a delegation system to be able to have one control room work with any of the, of the TV sets. We don't have equipment that, that sleeps 80% of the time. We decided to pull everything that could be pulled together so that we could get a better usage out of it. You need a robust interface to be able to build comprehensive workflow that are easy to use and hide most of the complexity from the daily operation. With a simple touch of a button, we connect this control room to any of the studios that are available in the infrastructure. VSM was programmed in-house uh, with uh, our uh, own uh, technicians. There's playout that is completely separated from production under a separate broadcast controller. We built the new Maison network uh, with multiple islands and we want to be able to interconnect these islands together without allowing uh, unwanted traffic to flow through. There was large consultations among the employees of Radio Canada and as well as with the users of the technology. We definitely want to allow work from home, work from your hotel room, work from the field, so that be able to access the system from everywhere is key in all our design would not have been possible to realize this project without uh, manufacturer cooperation. It was a nice uh, give and take between us and the industry to bring the equipments, the different pieces of gear up to speed. And from the production point of view, it gives us more flexibility. I like to say we're all IP specialists, we're not. The partnership, working out problems together, was key to make this project successful. It was a difficult project, but it worked. It's working amazingly well, and I'm really proud of my, my team of uh, people that, that worked on, on the project. 
The NMRC project, I think, is in constant evolution. It's a work of art in progress, for sure.